Welcome to another edition of Frankly Green Bay, brought to you by Kathy Kolbick of Waterstone Mortgage and the Press Times. Today, we have the myth, the legend, you know him from Denmark, TV Tommy. Welcome to another edition of Frankly Green Bay. Got the myth, the legend, TV Tommy from Denmark, Wisconsin. What's going on, buddy? Not much, Frank. Not, not much. You're looking not, good, buddy. Uh, I'm, I'm getting old, bub. I'm getting old. <laughs> getting Come old. on. So we both are. Yes, and you're, you're a little, little ways to go yet. A little but. ways to go. Let's talk about how this all thing started with you, the, the bet, and what, what people need to know. Why are you TV Tommy? Without name dropping, yeah. without really name dropping, I will acknowledge those people in Vegas at your show, yeah. you know, put a little spotlights in spots, but I don't want to acknowledge, you know, yeah. name drop right now. But yes, I had went to Hollywood, Came back, I flunked, I never even got close to the TV, you know. <laughs> I never got close to a TV show, come back for a wedding. Uh, I won't name drop the wedding, but um, uh, one bet led to the next, one thing led to the next. I couldn't get on the stage at the old Carlton. Remember the old the Carlton? Carlton West. Carlton, Carlton West. Carlton, Somebody yeah. said I couldn't be on that stage. It got up to $2,000. I guess I'll jump out of a plane for $2,000 without a parachute. Okay. And the rest is history. And let's talk about that show. You got into magic. Um... Or was it more than that? No, 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 no. So, so, so I tried, tried a little comedy, and you know, went back to I was, I was in a bar at the time. Went back to the bar. Well, now what am I gonna do? I ended up getting that little, little twenty-minute spot in this in the Carlton. And so now, what am I gonna do? I had no yeah. clue. Yeah. I'm not a comedian. I wasn't a magician. I, I was a wrestler in Denmark. You know, a sports. Yeah. You know, no talent. But that's why the back. Started so that you had you had no show no. and you got into the Carlton West. What did you do? I paid the girl twenty dollars <laughs> to get me a spot with the older. I walked in on my Carl. Knees. We know you, Carl. Carl. Yeah. Carl. I walked in on my knees when I got in the door. I said, "I got a five minute story. It's a rich man, poor man act." Yeah. And he fell for it. And for the rest is I, history. Yes, I had seven hundred people at that first show, and it worked. It worked. It worked. So I kept doing magic you know, around all the places. I took it to Vegas. I took a bird, a rabbit, and a snake as far as it would go in <laughs> Las Vegas. Let's talk about that. You go to Las Vegas, and you, you told me the story of bird, rabbit, and a snake. Why do you need animals in Vegas? Well, you, you, <laughs> you got to have something to disappear. You know, you can make a girl disappear, one of the, the assistants. But, and I use the line, a bird, a rabbit, and a snake. Yeah. See, which in Vegas... You gotta have lions and tigers and bears. Yeah, exactly. And not a bird, a rabbit, and a snake. I got no farther in that corner in that. <laughs> but I work Las Vegas. Yes. TV Tommy, you're out there in Vegas. You come back to, 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 to the Denmark area. You had bars and other things. But one of the things that people remember you was your TV show. How did that get started? Pick of the week? Yeah. Pretty simple. Somebody said, how do you get on TV? Well, you buy your way on TV. <laughs> I didn't have no talent. I bought my way on TV. So then that was the next step of, well, how do I get these two people on? Well, so then I, I picked it. I'm going to let them talk about football. It, a little bit about gambling. It's okay. gambling. Yeah. You pick the games against the spread. But I put two, two people that would have no shot at being yeah. right here. On a stage, you know. Well, TV Tommy, talking about going to Las Vegas and doing a trip, we got a trip coming up. So join us next week as we talk about TV Tommy Presents Let Me Be Franks at the Las Vegas Plaza. Tell you what, that guy is a character. Wait till you see him next week. We talk about the show and, and, and being in Vegas. Let's get to my picks this week. Hey, you want to see the king? Speaking of Vegas, you can come up to Pine Mountain Resort this Sunday. Frank's Christmas tribute will be at Pine Mountain Resort. The tickets are still available. Dinner and show. It's our all Christmas tribute show. Number three, my Christmas show. Hey, Friday and Saturday at the Meyer Theater. Rave reviews. Standing ovations this last weekend. Come and see the first Christmas. One AD. I play the Pharaoh. Look at that picture. I love it. <laughs> Number two, greetings at the Green Bay Community Theater. This is a wonderful, wonderful play. Get out and see it. It's Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And my number one pick of the week, I think they were here the other day. Yesterday, a Christmas yeah. Carol, the musical. I was in this 20 years ago at the Widener Center. It's a great, great show at the De Pere Birder Theater. Uh, shows Friday, Saturday, and Sunday at 4 o'clock. Okay, all the details on Facebook at... Frankly, Green Bay. That's me. That's me right there. They're really? Yeah. Like kinda. they traced you? I look a little... I, I think they maybe look skinnier in that one. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, thanks, Frank. Thanks. Hey,